See, God fulfills his promise of giving us a new heart and a new spirit. When we receive Jesus Christ as our Lord and Savior, the Holy Spirit's ministry is to regenerate the new believer, causing them to be born again by his spirit. It was promised and prophesied in Ezekiel 36, verses 26 and 27. And Jesus revealed it in his conversation with Nicodemus. John 3, verses 5 and 6. Ezekiel 36, let's read. I will give you a new heart. That implies you have or had an old heart. And put a new spirit within you, which tells us you had an old spirit in you. And I will remove the heart of stone, so we know what type of heart that old heart was, and will give you a heart of flesh. That's the new heart. I will place my spirit within you. So this is the Holy Spirit saying, I will reside in you. And cause you to walk in my statutes. This is the royal law of love. I will cause you to walk in my statutes and carefully observe my ordinances of loving God with all your heart, soul, mind, and strength, and your neighbor as yourself. That fulfills the law of Christ. Jesus' conversation with Nicodemus. John 3, 5, and 6, just a grasp, a little portion. Jesus answered, I assure you, unless someone is born of water and spirit, natural birth and birth by the spirit, he cannot enter the kingdom of heaven. Whatever is born of flesh is flesh. We understand that natural birth. Whatever is born of the spirit is spirit.